If you're thinking of making a move to West Palm Beach, then I have a great neighborhood suggestion for you, Flamingo Park in West Palm Beach. My name is Michael Lee, your realtor of the Palm Beaches, and my job is to help you find the best hidden gems in Palm Beach County, whether that be a $5 million home on the ocean or a nice townhouse in the middle of the city. I hope you guys consider subscribing to the channel where you guys can stay updated on new neighborhood tours as well as property tours. Now, I just want to give you guys a little bit of background information about Flamingo Park and why I think it is a great neighborhood for families as well. Um, Flamingo Park consists of about 556 homes and located just south of downtown West Palm Beach where you'll find entertainment such as restaurants, shops, as well as the Intracoastal where we have tons of events from the city as well. Um, it's zoned historic, which means those homes are built between the 1920s and 30s, and they're often a Spanish or Mediterranean style in design. And it's a highly desired community as well. Um, West Palm Beach has about 16 historic communities in total, and this is one of the most highly desired communities to be in as well. Reason why, you have great neighborhood schools, as well as great access to I-95, the airport, as well as shops being right across the street from Rosemary Square, formerly known as City Place. Now, let me share my screen with you guys in the office so I can show you guys exactly where Flamingo Park is in connection with the amenities, the airport, as well as access to I-95. So you guys can get an idea of exactly where this beautiful neighborhood is. A map of Flamingo Park from above. As you can see, this little box here is the entire community of Flamingo Park. 586 total homes make up the neighborhood of Flamingo Park and if I zoom out here you guys can see the proximity of where it's located in relation to Palm Beach. West Palm Beach downtown is right here so it's maybe about a five minute drive. You can even walk it on great days like today. You can even walk to downtown West Palm Beach where you can enjoy new restaurants, new shops as well that they're building here as well as the Palm Beach International Airport. So if you have family coming in for holidays or you need to go to New York and come back for the same day or in two days, you don't have to drive 45 minutes to an hour down to Fort Lauderdale, Miami. You can just hop right here to the PBI International Airport. And that's maybe about a 10 minute drive, maybe less if you have the right time to leave early in the morning. You also have access to Palm Beach Island with the two bridges here. That's about a 15 minute drive. That's where you have Worth Ave, your Palm Beach Island shops and little boutiques, which are amazing if you have a chance to go over there and see it, as well as the Intercoastal, which is here, and the Atlantic Ocean, some of the best ocean views in America, I believe. Now, if I zoom in and just show you guys in relation to what you have as far as amenities, you have here is the new downtown West Palm Beach, Rosemary Square that's happening as well where you have shops such as Harry's, Police, you have a Publix here, you have a LA Fitness here, you have Hilton where business conferences are done as well. A lot of activities going on. And then you have the West Palm Beach Green Market going on as well as the new Palm Beach Boat Show that's coming in a few weeks as well. So you have tons of amenities around. And like I said, the neighborhood is even walking distance from all these activities as well. So now let's just show you some live shots of the neighborhood so you can get a feel of what the neighborhood actually looks like in real time.